How to remove the background from an image on a mobile device. This tutorial is for complex multicolor backgrounds. If the background is a single color, like a white background, check out this video for a much simpler method. So we're going to save the image we want to edit, and then we're going to go and download UDoodle from the App Store, or the equivalent on Android. Opening UDoodle, we have a blank canvas, so we'll hit File, Import, Edit a Photo, and bring in the photo we want to edit. So we're going to select the scissors icon at the bottom and get it at about that setting. You can change a little bit if you want. And then we're going to zoom in on our photo a little bit. Once we've zoomed in a comfortable amount, we're going to begin tracing the outline of the image using our finger. And there's a magnifying glass icon that appears in the top left to help you see exactly what you're on. After tracing part of the outline of our image, we're going to circle back around and close the shape. Then tap inside the contour and select cut. This will remove part of the background that borders the image we want, and you'll see the transparent background underneath. We then will repeat this until we've gone around the entire image. If you make a mistake, you can always hit the undo button, and if you draw the contour line where you don't want it, you can switch to a different tool and that'll make it disappear, then switch back to the scissors and keep going. Once we've finished cutting out the border, we're going to zoom out a little bit and make some final big cuts just to remove a lot of the extra background around the image. It's okay to leave some background in the corners because we're going to be cropping that out later anyway. Once most of the background is removed, we'll hit File, Save, and save it to our camera roll. Then we'll turn around and do File, Import, import the photo we just saved, and now crop it down to the size that eliminates the remaining background. We have now successfully removed the background, and to show you that it works, I will import this over a different background, and you'll see the original is no longer there, uh, so we can Photoshop certain images onto other backgrounds and do what we want. One trick to get rid of any imperfections in the cut that you did around the image is to select the three dots and then add a glow to it. Um, you can play around with the colors and the uh, opacity and size of the glow, but that can make it look a little cleaner on the background and a little bit less cut out. 